Mesa TV presents in three, two, one. Dateline Schools with your host, Terry Harrington. Well, this weekend, Dateline Schools has been learning more about the Blue Water Middle College and talking with the director from the Middle College, Pete Spencer. And, and Pete, what are the students saying about the program and how, how they, you know, what kind of reaction do they have to this whole thing? Well, it's, it's usually very positive, uh, all the way from the extreme. I love this program, which literally they'll come in my office and say that after they've, after they've been on campus for a few weeks. Um, and, and most students, though, really are enjoying it. And, and they talk about the challenge um, of the courses, uh, uh, some of the things that, that occur in the classes. I think some of the discussions are at higher levels. Um, and so they, they, they really like that. They also talk about the workload being harder, though, and that's what we tell them it's going to be, and sure enough, it is. Um, they, they talk a lot about balancing, having to balance their schedule, think ahead, don't procrastinate. They see that when that happens, it, it clearly affects, you know, how they do in their courses. Um, there was one student that, that had commented on a sheet that we had given them about, you know, looking for comments like this, that, that uh, it was a great decision, and she had in parentheses, that my parents made. So initially, but then she goes on to say, I'm really glad that I'm part of this. But uh, sometimes, you know, the parents will say, well, this is really something you should try, um, but we hope the students will, will come to enjoy it as well, and, and I think they are. Sure. If a parent came up to you and said, eh, Mr. Spencer, why should I consider this program for my, stu my child? What, what would you tell them? I think a lot of it, I'd probably come back with some questions about uh, their, their child, their son or daughter. And um, the, the, uh, one of the things is, you know, do they seem like they're ready, you know, for a new challenge? And, and some students clearly are. I mean, they're, they're going to high school, but they're, they're just, you know, they, they can kind of do high school and they're looking for, for a challenge. It doesn't mean they're always getting all A's either. It mm -hmm. could just be that they need that extra uh, uh, challenge in their life. Um, also, you know, academically, we want to make sure that they're ready. We don't have minimum requirements, but if a student really been struggling um, it may not be best to start the college classes junior year although we've seen we've seen good successes there um, and then finally I guess if a student has plans for college but they they'd like to go to college but they seem like they'd be nervous and anxious about attending school this is a great way for them to build up their confidence in doing college work and, and it's really going to likely succeed uh, in, the, in a four-year program down the road. I know there's a lot of opportunities coming up the next few weeks for parents to learn more and students to learn more about the program. Where can they get more information? Well, probably the easiest thing to mention in the program would be the website um, and because we'll have information there of these parent information, parent student information sessions, and then my contact information as well. And that would be the sccresa.org slash BWMC, and that will get you. If you just go to the RESA website, there's a link to the Middle College, um, and, and that's probably your best source. And if nothing else, just go there and, and give me a call or an email, and I'll get you the information. Okay, great. For Dateline Schools, I'm Terry Harrington. Dateline Schools is a production of St. Clair County RESA.